In this class we are going to discuss about uh, a gate problem. So, related to combinational circuit design. You can observe the problem here. The minimal function that can detect a divisible by 3, 8, 4 to 1 BCD code digit. Representation is D8, D4, D2, D1 they mentioned and is given by. We need to find divisible by 3 function. Uh, which uh, in, in BCD 8421 BCD code, in 8421 BCD code, so which code is divisible by 3 that function we need to implement here. So, now this is very very important point here 8421 BCD which gives you so much information to solve this problem. That means you know about BCD. So, 8421 BCD is nothing but up to 9 only because 8421 is nothing but 4 bit code. So, 4 bit BCD code will start from 0 and ends with 9. From 10 onwards that means you need to take 1 separately and 0 separately. That means you need to take a minimum of 5 bits and maximum of 8 bits to represent 2 digit numbers that means 10 onwards 10, 11, 12, 13 like that you need to take at least 5 bits to represent in BCD. So, here by using this 4 bit code how many BCD numbers you can represent means. So, just you need to consider from 0 to 9. So, you can have 10 to 15 by using 8, 4 to 1, but those are not caring here that means those are taken as do not case as we considered BCD code. So, now that 4 digits 8421 4 digits uh, representation they given in the problem as D8, D4, D2, D1. So, I taken D8, D4, D2, D1 for BCD code here I am taking D1. So, now for BCD representation, so BCD is similar to binary up to 9 that means 0 to 9 BCD is similar to binary. So, here I am writing the codes. So, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 1 and 0, 0, 1, 0 and 0, 0, 1, 1 and 0, 1, double 0, 0, 1, 0, 1, 5 and 6, 0, double 1, 0, 7, 0, triple 1, 8, 1, triple 0 and 9, 1001. These are the BCD 4 bit BCD codes we are having the possibilities of 4 bit BCD codes. So, from 9 onwards we can represent remaining numbers that is 10, 11, 12, 13, 14 with 4 bits, but those are not said to be BCD because for BCD so, we cannot represent 1010 as 10, we need to represent 1 separately, 0 separately. Your functionality is you need to define functionality for divisible by 3 circuit. So, that means whatever the digits divisible by 3, whatever uh, code value is divisible by 3, that function need to enable there. So, here 0 is divisible by 3. Yes, 0 by 3 is equal to 0. So, 0 is divisible by any number. So, you can uh, enable your function here and at place of 3, 3 is divisible by 3 and at place of 6, 6 is divisible by 3 and at place of 9, 9 is also divisible by 3. Now, at remaining places you can take zeros here. So, you can take zeros like this. So, we take in our required functionality that is divisible by 3 function. Now, this is the time to uh, define the boolean function for this functionality by using kmap. How many variable kmap we need to consider means this functionality is uh, derived from this input variables or this input bits. How many input variables or bits we are having means 4. So, that many variable kmap we need to consider. So, here we need to consider 4 variable k map. So, I am considering 4 variable k map here. So, with 16 boxes. So, 4 variable k map contains 16 boxes. So, here I am taking that 16 boxes. So, here I am considering D8, D4, 
and here I am considering D2, D1. The possibilities are 0, 0, 0, 1, 1, 0, 1, 1, 0, 0, 0, 1, 1, 0, 1, 1. Now, I am going to place the cell values for simplification. Yes, I am going to consider in terms of min terms or if you want to uh, put the number of ones readily in the boxes, you just take the cell values like this. So, this cell value is 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. These are the cell values. Like this you need to write the cell values. Now, where your function is 1 means at 0 place. So, if you are not going to take the cell values, how you are going to put 1 means? When D8, D4, 0, 0 and D2, D1, 0, 0. Here you are having one like that you need to see. So, if you take in the cell values as you know the value of this binary or BCD directly you can place. Where you are having one means at 0 you are having one, at 3 you are having one, at 6 you are having one. In gate you are not going to take this table, truth table. Why? Because by taking cell values like this you can directly uh, know what are uh, values divisible by 3. You can directly take K map. In gate like exam no need to waste time by making truth table. You just take a K map with these variables and you just make cell values and uh, 0 is div divisible by 3 and 3 is divisible by 3, 6 is divisible by 3 and another one is 9 is divisible by 3. And 10 onwards you can represent 10 onwards you can represent the 4 bit code but that is not taken care for BCD. So those are taken as don't cares from 10 to 15. So 10 to 15 I am taking as don't cares 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15 all these are taken as don't cares. So now this is the time for grouping to get the boolean expression. So, I am grouping a quarter like this, I am grouping like this, a quarter with this one, with the all don't cares and one, this double I am grouping and here I am grouping opposite double with this don't care and here this single one, it can't be grouped with any number of ones. So, that is why I group uh, with individually. So, here I am taking the value of this function now, I am taking the value of this quarter, sideways it is covering two cells, this quarter, these two cells. So, combination is 1, that one represents D8, topwise it is covering two cells again, the combination is 1, that one represents D1, plus I am taking the value of this prime implicant, sideways it is covering two boxes. The combination is 1, 1 represents D4 here. So, now top wise it is covering single cell, you need to take as it is that means D2, D1 bar. So, now plus I am taking this opposite group double with this don't care. So, it is also covering two boxes, combination is 0 in these two, that 0 represents D4 bar, D4 bar. Top wise it is covering single cell that is 1, 1, 1, 1 represents D2 d1 there plus finally I am taking the value of this single grouped prime implicate. So, both sides you are having zeros that means d8 bar, d4 bar, d2 bar and d1 bar. So, this is the value or expression boolean expression related to this required function that is divisible by 3 function. So, you just match with these options. So, I think option B is the right option for this question. So, this is the right option for this question. In this type of questions when solving in gate, you no need to take this uh, whatever uh, uh, truth table is there, no need to take truth table directly you can take KMAP and cell values like this. You just uh, directly take where you are having uh, divisible by 3, 0 divisible by 3, 3 divisible by 3, 6 and 1, 9 you are having as divisible by 3. Remaining from 10 onwards you just consider do not cares because from 10 onwards we can represent with 8, 4, 2, 1 but that is not considered as BCD, that is not caring as BCD, we are uh, taking that as do not care 
we are not carrying 10 onwards so that's why we consider it as don't cares so remaining don't cares you no need to group that don't cares you need to use for grouping of ones if don't cares are left no need to group that don't cares so like this way you can solve this type of problems